Three people were arrested in a prostitution sting that span, spanned multiple houses in Edmond and in Oklahoma City. News 9's Angelicia Bruton has more from police and neighbors about what they've noticed leading up to those arrests. Angelicia? Edmond officers assisted OKC police with a prostitution investigation they've been looking into for months. Many neighbors say that there was something off about their neighbors, but they were shocked to hear the details. We would find random cars parked out in front of my house. Just it, men, all men, just sitting in their cars, being on their phones, and they would be sitting out there for a long period of time. Rihanna Olson knew it was time to contact the police when it went from random cars parked throughout her neighborhood to random men knocking on her door. OKC police say tips from the community like this is what led to the arrest of Sheng Feng Tan, Jiao Sheng Chu, and Wu Zhen. We executed two search warrants. The Edmonds Special Investigations Unit executed one of the search warrants on the residents in Edmond. Oklahoma City Vice Unit executed the other search warrant. Inside, we found several items of dominion and control. We made multiple arrests on complaints of aiding and abetting and, and prostitution. Court documents detail detectives going undercover. Once inside, it states she attempted to have sex with a UC Vice detective for $200. Detectives also found thousands of dollars in between mattresses. One suspect also admitted to directing customers to the female sex worker's room. Olson says it all makes sense now. There was a, a full semi sitting out in front of our house for almost an hour, and my kids saw a lady come out of the house, get the guy out of the truck, escort him into the house, and then escort him back out to his truck about an hour or so after that. She says they were home when they got arrested and hopes she never has to deal with this again. It's very nerve-wracking and I hate it. OKC police believe that there are more arrests to be made, and this is an ongoing investigation. In Oklahoma City, Angelicia Bruton, Oklahoma Zone, News 9. All right, Angelicia.